This is Joseph Drust, and welcome back to another episode of Ask ZBrush. So we had a question sent in asking, how can I fix duplicate named subtools inside of ZBrush? So here I just have the rifle model loaded in, and as you can see, all the subtools for this rifle have the same name. Now for the most part, this isn't going to cause any issues, but if you use something like Transpose Master, it's going to be looking at the names of these subtools, and you may not have the file transposed correctly until you go through and fix all these duplicate names. So depending on how many subtools you have in your tool, it could possibly take a while to go through and individually rename each one. Luckily, there's a process inside of ZBrush that will automatically do this for you. So to do this, we first need to navigate up here to the Z plugin tab, and then we're going to locate the Subtool Master plugin here and we're simply going to click this Do Visible button. Now when you click this Do Visible button, it's going to open up and you're going to get a little menu like so. One of the options in this menu is to correct duplicate subtool names. So I'm just going to make sure I have that option selected, and then I'm simply going to hit OK. Now after that is processed, you'll notice it has gone through across all your subtools, and it's going to make sure that every subtool in this list has a unique name. So you can see now I only have one subtool labeled subtool, and then everything else has had a underscore copy appended to it with a number. So now this is going to give you all different subtool names across all your tools there. And now you can use, say, Transpose Master to pose your mesh as desired. If you have any other questions related to ZBrush pipelines or processes, please use the hashtag AskZBrush on Twitter. Happy ZBrushing!